Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks. I'm not 100% sure I understand, but this gentleman uh, blended these items around here, and then he wanted to enlarge it, and it evidently didn't work and spaced them out, and well, it, it's, and it made them an oval. Uh, it's not going to work unless you change. So I made two sets of that. It's a point one line. So I took the first one that was his original, and I went to Windows, Dockers, and Properties and measure it by here with this, and it's 10.49 sub it. Can't hardly get closer than 10 and a half. I just enlarged it and got really lucky and made it almost exactly 14 and a half. Uh, you could actually add to that like 138.1 and make it almost uh, 14 and a half exactly. So we're going to take we're going to close this, go up to effects and to blend, and we're going to grab these two circles. I like doing them in, in hairlines, and I want to make sure they are. Yep, they're both hairlines, and that could have been a problem. Okay, grab the two. Get out of calculator. We need a 10.5 divided by 0.1 is 105. I've already done it just to make sure it works. But why do I have 103? Well, because I've already got two. So you take those away and you got 103. Hit apply. New path. Put on the path. Blend along full path. You do not have to rotate the object because they're around. And you can't get any closer than that. Now the second one, we need to take our two objects. I want to make sure. Yeah, I, I doubled up on my duplicate. This time, calculator 14.5 divided by 0 0.1 is 145. Well, we've already got two, so we need 143. Hit apply. Blend along new path. Blend along full path. And look at that. They're dead on. Now, to get rid of that line, you've got to select it all, make sure you get it all, go up to object and break the blend apart, go ahead and select it all again, and go to object and ungroup it. And then if you ever have trouble getting that line, you can always take one of your little bitty circles and move it out of the way, click on your line and hit delete, and then move your circle back, and you're back right where you were. I'm hoping that was the question. If not, I'm sure he'll let me know. Anyway, I hope that helped. Thank you for watching.